Did you know that your exposure to light can affect your mental health? It's a fascinating subject that has been recently studied with some compelling findings. It turns out that when we're exposed to high levels of light during the nighttime, our risk for developing a range of mental health conditions, including depression, psychosis, and anxiety, increases by a startling 30%. In contrast, when we soak up plenty of light during the day, we can actually reduce our risk of depression by 20% and lower the likelihood of developing other mental health conditions. This certainly makes you think twice about late night screen time and the importance of getting outside during the day, doesn't it? But this doesn't just happen by chance. There's actual science behind these effects. So how does light exposure influence our mental health? Let's dive into the science behind it. The secret lies in our body's natural clock, the circadian rhythm. This internal timekeeper regulates our sleep-wake cycle, hormone release, eating habits, and digestion. It's essentially our body's way of synchronizing with the Earth's rotation. Now imagine what happens when we tinker with this finely tuned system. That's where the concept of light exposure comes in. Our circadian rhythm is primarily influenced by light and darkness. During the day, exposure to natural light signals our bodies to stay awake and alert. As darkness falls, it cues us to rest and rejuvenate. However, with our modern lifestyle we often find ourselves staying up late under artificial lights, disrupting this natural cycle. This misalignment can lead to a host of problems, including mental health issues. A study found that high exposure to light at night increases the risk of developing conditions such as depression, psychosis, bipolar disorder, anxiety, and even PTSD by 30%. On the flip side, getting plenty of light during the day can reduce the risk of depression by 20% and lower the likelihood of other mental health conditions. Even the type of light matters. Blue light emitted by screens and certain light bulbs can be particularly disruptive. It's been linked to reduced sleep duration, further underscoring the importance of minimizing screen time at night. So it's not just about how much light we're exposed to, but when and what kind of light it is. Essentially, our bodies have evolved to respond to the natural ebb and flow of daylight and darkness. When we try to override this system with artificial light, it can throw our circadian rhythm off balance, leading to a range of health issues. Now that we understand the science, what can we do to use this knowledge to our advantage? Whether it's adjusting our daily routines, modifying our environment, or being more mindful of our screen time, there are ways we can align our lifestyle with our body's natural rhythm. Let's delve into these strategies in the next scene. Here are some practical tips to align your light exposure with your natural body clock. Let's dive right in. First, make it a habit to soak up some natural light every morning. This simple routine can help you kickstart your day, reduce the risk of depression by 20%, and lower the likelihood of developing other mental health conditions. Next, consider setting up your workspace near a window. The exposure to daylight can significantly improve your mood productivity, and overall well-being. And if you work in an environment with limited natural light, using a bright light box, especially during fall and winter months, can be an effective substitute. Now let's talk about nighttime. As much as possible, reduce your screen time as the evening approaches. The blue light emitted from screens can disrupt your circadian rhythm, leading to sleep disturbances and associated mental health risks. You can also tweak your phone settings to decrease blue light exposure. Many devices today offer a night mode or blue light filter setting that can make a significant difference in your light exposure after sunset. Remember, it's all about balance. Too much light at night can increase the risk of developing mental health conditions by 30%. But with these small adjustments, you can harness the power of light to improve your mental health. By following these simple tips, you can harness the power of light to improve your mental health. Knowledge is power, especially when it comes to mental health. It's crucial to stay updated on the latest research and understand how everyday factors like light exposure can impact our well-being. Equally important is the practice of self-care. Prioritizing your needs, whether it's spending time in daylight or reducing screen time at night, can significantly enhance your mental health. Remember, your wellness journey is a marathon, not a sprint. Don't forget to subscribe for the latest updates on mental health at Glee Glow Junction. We're dedicated to keeping you informed and empowered. Take care, and remember, together we can build a supportive and resilient community. Stay tuned for the next Glee Glow Junction.